We, I just don't know what that animatronic or whatever it was that I saw. I mean, who was it? It talked to me, but it seemed almost scared. It didn't scared. attack me or anything. How do you know who I am? Um, well, I think we might be brothers. Is someone going to explain what the heck is going on? All right, Freddy, I'm about to head out for the night. Is <laughs> Okay, I'm going to take that as everything is not okay. What's going on? Am I a bad boyfriend? Oh, boy. Not this conversation, Freddy. I'm going to be late for my deal with Bonnie. Why do you think you're a bad boyfriend? Roxanne wants to come over, and she wants to talk about something serious with me. <laughs> okay. The last time she said that she wanted to talk about something Serious? I was the one that said it, and I was the one that broke up with her. Yikes. There's a million things that she be, could be coming over for, Freddy. I'm sure it's not that. If anything, you know what it probably is? It's probably she's mad at, at me because um the, 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 the Michael Afton stuff. I, I took Gregory there. I shouldn't have. I know. But it's probably just a conversation about that. I'm sure it's nothing that you need to panic about. I don't know. Sometimes it's just, you know, me and her just chatting for a little bit after we had, we send each other emojis and all that. I sent her a question mark emoji. She just says, I'll see you soon. Well, who sends question mark emojis? I bought one of those encyclopedia emojis. I don't even know what that means. You are such a dad sometimes. I mean, is, is Gregory coming with her? No, he he's staying home. I asked the, that same question and she said, no, this is a conversation that mainly needs to stick between me and her. Well, that does sound mildly concerning um well have you done anything bad in the past little bit is there anything she could be mad about maybe she figured out that you lied about the hair thing and now she knows that i went along with your lie i mean there's no way she would have found out about that i didn't tell her you and i are the only people that know about it oh wait you know what it is what the other night i didn't make dinner for her it was my turn and i decided to phone it in and i ordered a bunch of pizzas instead of making a proper dinner for so, all three of us so you think because you didn't cook that she's on her way over here to have a conversation Bruh. that's no no freddie that's not what it, look do you need me to stay and and mediate the the conversation or, or anything or no no I, I can cancel my plans with bonnie and um no, no. You've been doing a lot for me in the last week or so, and as much as I hate what you did with Gregory and bringing him along to a dangerous situation, you do deserve to have a night to yourself with Bonnie. I mean, when was the last time you and him properly had a night together with yourselves? I mean, it has been a while, but I mean, you're important to me. You're my best bud, so if, if you need something, just... I get it. You're like a sister to me too, but you need your time with someone you can be more open with, I guess. All right. I mean, I, I suppose. Uh, I guess if it is a serious conversation too, it's probably best that you and Roxanne have the house. Just don't get all weird and nervous and sweaty and clammy like you usually do. Just just play it cool and just hear her out with whatever it is. I can only promise two of those things I can try to prevent. Okay, well, in that case, I'm out of here. I guess just, just call if you need something. I really don't think it's a breakup, but if it is, just give me a call, text SOS or something, and I'll bring home Ben and Jerry's ice cream and we can watch sad movies all night. All right? All right. All right. I'll, uh, I'll see you later, Freddy. Thanks, and you have a good night. Just don't worry about me or what, Roxanne. Just enjoy a night to yourself with Bonnie, okay? I'll try. You two deserve to have a good night to yourselves. Just let me know if you need anything, okay? Will do. <sighs> come on, come on, come on. What do I do? What do I do? What does she want to talk about? What if she wants to break up? No, 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 no. What if she wants to move to the next step and have me move in with her and Gregory? God, I can't do that to Circus Baby right now. She can't live by herself with her and Ennard. She'll be so bad and... Bruh. Oh, God, I think... She's here. Okay, breathe. Breathe, Freddy, breathe. All right. All right. Hey, Roxanne. Hi. Hey. <clears throat> Hi. Uh, you said you needed to talk to me, right? Yes, I I do. We have uh, quite a bit to discuss. Um... I, I'm sorry for whatever I did. I... I'm, I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to do what I did. Freddy, what do you mean? I don't know why you're... Are you mad at me? Are you upset? 
Is this a breakup we gotta talk kind of deal? Uh, what is making you think that? D did you do something? Oh, I thought you might have been still mad about the hair thing. Oh, I've gotten over, well... I'm still annoyed about the hair thing, but that was Circus, baby. Uh, yeah, but look, the last time any of either one of us sent the we need to talk text, that ended up with us breaking up, so... Okay, I, I guess I understand, but look, it's... I don't even know where to begin. Um, it's not... that. Oh, you're not breaking up with me? No, I'm, I'm not breaking up with you. This is... Something a lot more serious, if I'm being completely honest. Did something happen with Gregory? No, no, Gregory's... Gregory's fine. Though we need to talk to Circus Baby about not putting him into dangerous situations, because I'm also annoyed about that. I think we all need to. Good, I'm glad we're on the same page. But no, it's not about Gregory, it's about... It's about us as a, a family. Um, I just... This was a conversation I thought we would have someday, and I thought it would go very differently, you know, after w we got married, but for real, and, and we were living together, and things were on very different terms, but things changed. Um, Are you pregnant? Uh, well, here's, here's the thing. I thought we were safe. I thought we took all the necessary no, okay, precautions. Okay, no, let, mm, we don't have to get into that, Freddy. Look, we we have a son. Oh my kind God. of. It, it's it's weird. It's a really weird situation. Wait, what? I'm not pregnant, but um, I think it would be better if we just had him uh, introduce himself. Uh, you can come in. Uh, oh. hello. What? The uh, hi. uh dad uh, I mean I mean Freddy. Uh hello. Your father Freddy. Um, what is happening? I uh, guess uh you want to introduce yourself? Uh hi. I'm prototype 402-3. Uh, we haven't come up with an official name yet. I think uh, as long as you're comfortable with it, we should all talk about about that at some point, but okay, I I know I'm still trying to digest all of this myself, but um, this is our son, kind of. Hi. Uh, How though? Okay, y you know um probably even more than I do the the stuff with Michael Afton. Yeah. Michael built a prototype 402-3. But he he built him from stolen code, uh, basically animatronic DNA and um, our parts. What? Uh, have you recently lost anything? Yeah, been we've been dealing with a string of thefts and wait, wait, you said Michael built him, right? Yeah. Oh my, that explains it. You yeah, know, it explains one of Michael's old labs we discovered. We found a broken down version of me, like a clone. With a bunch of the stolen parts already in there. Well, we know what they were used for, I suppose. You know, the other day I told you about the mimic showing up and putting a code into my head, the whole chip thing, but now parts and service didn't find anything of it. Um, well, it was a fake mimic that stole my code and used it to put into our supposed son. So, uh, the point being, by all... Weird technicality, I, d despite not being created by you and I, he is our son, genetically. What's your name then? I told you, it's Prototype 402-3. He never gave him a name? I suppose not. With the 402-3, I'm assuming there were probably multiples. There was other of our children? I don't know about that. Just maybe unsuccessful attempts to build animatronics. I don't know. I'm still trying to unpack everything here. What was he planning on doing with this? Well, um, 402-3. We're really going to need to come up with a different name. Bruh. You said that you were basically built to be Michael's right-hand man to do whatever he needed you to do, and that's why you were at his house the other night. Yes, that is correct. And I'm sure Circus Baby told you about the red eyes peering in at, um, William. Well, I'm pretty sure 
Those were it. Wait, that was your eyes? Yeah. Um, I, I didn't- I didn't mean to, though. You didn't hurt anyone. All you did was frighten some people. I think we've all been guilty of that one, at least. I've been guilty, then, of more than that, but Gregory already knows as well. Uh, Gregory actually is oh. the one that he came to first. What? Yes, um, I- I'm, I'm sorry again for breaking in. It's- uh, it's fine. I, I'm glad you did. We need to- Install you some better doors and security, by the way. My house has an open roof. Honestly, I should probably just move, but at least this situation was, um, different, right? Yeah. No, I'm not- mm. I'm not angry or upset. I'm just confused more than anything. I am also confused and trying to understand everything, but I just want to make sure we're all on the same page here and- Trying to figure out what to do from here forward. Um, like I was mentioning, uh, Gregory knows and is fine, and if anything, is more excited that he has a, a brother. I mean, he sounded excited. I, I hope. No, uh, it, it absolutely is. He's probably going to be more excited about what he can do with a brother, honestly. Um, <laughs> I think from here, as long as everyone agrees, I, I want to get to know each other more. Um, maybe yeah. plan some family time? I, I don't know. Tell me, uh, prototype, uh, are you still working with Michael? Did you get away from him or something? Well, I can only really sneak out at night when Michael's not around, so... I'll have to go back soon. He's still actively with Michael, but I don't know how you feel about everything. I don't know if you're, you know, loyal to Michael, and if you are, I understand he is technically who built you, but at the same time, he built you illegally with stolen parts and code. It's like stealing our blood, essentially, and creating a clone from that. Exactly. So if you want, we can work together, get our lawyers involved, whatever we need to take you away from him. But what's to stop him from making more, though, I guess? I mean, he already has the parts and code. It's just a lot that we need to figure out, but at the very least, we all know each other now. Um, maybe we should get him a, a secret phone so we can stay in contact? Wait, I have the perfect thing, actually. Okay. Let me go get it full quick. It's in the garage. All right. Do you think it's safe? I still want to help, Michael. I understand. It's something I've been having some of the tech guys work on, but here, uh, Proto, uh, let me let me see your hat real quick. Uh, okay. And there, it's a new version of the Faz watch. Is it a freaking Faz hat? It is. Oh my gosh. They're doing the same thing with a wig version of your hair. I'm gonna have to talk to them about that, but. Okay. Yeah, but you can communicate with us using it, and I put in a signal frequency that only me, Roxanne, and Gregory would know. So when we use whenever we don't want to talk on a phone. I doubt Michael will pay attention to that. It's probably safer than using a cell phone. Yeah. I don't know what his intentions are. I can only imagine they're not great for you, so we'll work on getting you away from him, okay? Yeah. In the meantime, just stay safe and... If Michael is planning anything, maybe you could give us a heads up? If you feel comfortable. Yes. Uh, you have to remember, I mean, Michael did build him, so I'm sure there's a sense of loyalty there. Yeah, I understand. Look, I should probably be getting him back before um, Michael notices anything, but uh, I'll come back later, oh, okay? Yeah, we definitely need to talk more about this. Yeah. I don't know how to feel about you right now, but... I don't want anything bad to happen to you either. So just keep yourself safe, okay? Uh, will do. All right. Come on. Uh, bye. Bye. I'll see you later. Well, I'll talk to you later. 